right, guys, we are back. It is winter. Good thing I got my sweater on, my scarf. But I do like how they uh, uh, change the the scenery for us, right? Seasons change. Everything looks a little different. Frost on the trees. Frost on the ground. It's pretty cool. I like it. Die. Why are they looking at that thing's crotch? That's cool. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. I take it you're ready to learn your new spell. I completed yes. your assignment, Professor. I'm ready to learn Bombarda now. Good. Now, this spell comes with a caveat. It should only be used when necessary. Necessary to blow some shiz up. Can hurt people. Use caution when casting it. I will, Professor. I will hold you to that promise. Now, you must be precise in your wand movements. We don't want you blowing your hand off. Go ahead. Nice and steady wand movements. Remember, mm -hmm. the exploding charm is highly volatile. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kind of like fireworks on the 4th of July, you know? done now let us put it into practice shall we go ahead and try it on the pumpkins yes Bobada. Excellent Boom. cast the spell just like that every time assured and hope it deals more damage than Excellent. You have it well in hand. These are the same. Confringo. That's more flamey. Bombarda. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Oof. Dangerous to do that in the middle of the day. You'll never believe what I've learned. What did you discover in the spellbook we found Tell in the me. scriptorium? Tell me. Salazar Slytherin's spellbook was a little difficult to interpret, but fascinating. Evidently, he encouraged teaching dark magic at Hogwarts. Neither the Imperious Curse nor the Killing Curse was unforgivable during his time. He believed students should be prepared to use dark magic when necessary, not to fear it. That's why we had to use Crucio to gain access to the Scriptorium. He didn't want his knowledge shared with anyone who was afraid of the power of dark magic. Sure, yeah, we had to do what to we do, do. But casting Crucio was our only option. And I'm glad we did it. Because in the spellbook, I also found something else. References to a lost relic, which, from what I can tell, grants the holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. And you think this relic might be able to save Anne? Precisely. I plan to search for this relic, but I don't think we should tell anyone. Especially Ominous. He wouldn't understand. Sebastian's got a new best friend. And it's Seymour. Seymour Butt. Uh, I wouldn't say a word, you know, it's really his friend. I see no Not mine. reason to involve Ominous. I'm glad you agree. When I know more, I shall send an owl. 
And don't feel sorry for Ominous. Keeping this to ourselves for now is for his own good. I'll decide what's for my own good. <laughs> Ominous, <laughs> we were just about to get some air. Care to join? You're a liar, Sebastian. I heard everything. You swore you'd never engage in anything to do with dark magic again. No, I didn't. I said I understood you wanting that. I'd never swear to give up on finding a cure for Anne. You don't know when to stop, do you? I know when not to stop. Leave this alone, Ominous. I'll be on my way. Awkward. Oh, letting this go. Sure. Let's talk. And be more awkward about this. Ominous. Sebastian then well. I know what I heard. You knew I wouldn't agree with this. Going after that relic is not a good idea. Sebastian doesn't even realize it, but he's as irresponsible and reckless now as his parents were years ago. It's why they died. I knew his parents died, but I never heard what happened. Mr. and Mrs. Sallow were professors. Spent nearly every waking moment in the cellar library. Noses buried in books. Anne and Sebastian were upstairs when it happened. They heard a sudden crash and ran downstairs, but it was too late. Their parents had crumpled to the floor. A defect with the lamp in the cellar caused the room to fill with an undetectable toxin. Sebastian and Anne were helpless. They had no magic yet. What a horrible story. It is. That's why I can't understand Sebastian's recklessness. I've practically... Sounds like CO2. I cannot lose Sebastian too. You know, undetectable Please gas. avoid anything to do with that spell book. I don't know how that makes Sebastian the same as them. They That sounds just like they died from the fuel from the lamps. For reading? Like, doesn't make any sense. What are you talking about? Those references in the book seem promising. Everything to do with Salazar Slytherin seems promising until it's too late. I hope Sebastian pursues this no further. But if you think he might, please let me know. It would mean a lot. Y'all best friends, why don't you talk it out? See, this is a problem. Nobody's just like direct with each other anymore. They just beat around the bush. Say things that they don't entirely mean. Do uh, completely different things from what they say they will do. Anyways. Okay. <laughs> Who lived here, I wonder? Wait a second, let's uh take a minute. Look at the landscape now that it's all snowy. Pretty sweet. Man, he really does not descend as fast as a broom. Eh. This must be Tops's cave. Maybe it. Maybe I, I gotta be moving to be ascending faster.
Extreme danger. Lots of spiders. Extreme danger. Spiders. Beware of the spiders. That way. Do not enter. No wizards. No enter. Spiders. Ministry of Magic. Danger. 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 Incending. To make my way out, right? Tobs. Tobs. Deke sent me. Are you in here? Um. Down here. Imagine I can probably jump that. Okay. Down here first. Maybe something. Just some random cave fish or cave shark. There's a movie I watched. I forget what it's called. They're like in Mexico. And they um, jump into one of those caverns uh, with water, right? And apparently there's an under underwater cave system. And they're scuba diving in it. But what little do they know that it's actually filled with these sharks who... Basically, are blind anymore. They've been in the dark for ages or whatever, and they start attacking the crap out of them. Yeah. Yeah. Boom. This way first, just because it's not blocked, and I feel like, yeah, so that is. A little bit more damage, I guess. That's the same way, right? Just a ledge. Yeah. What the fuck? Your head go. Okay, so ginormous spider, got it. Uh, 
looks as if Tops was here some time ago. He must have headed deeper into the cave. Ow, 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 ow. Fucking mini spiders. Too soon. Ugh. That's a big hole. Fuck you, spiders. Well, then, snitch scarf. What does that give me? No trades. It's up one on offense, but this one's got the uh, unforgettable for the first. <laughs> Decreased damage taken from spiders. I think I'll continue wearing this, even though it's um, oh, it's actually less than offense. Like it. Go. If 
here looking for Tobbs. Seems he has dried up all the leeches here and must move deeper into the cave. Tobbs hopes Master will wait for him to return. It's too much. Uh, it's much too dangerous for Master to follow. And please be careful. It's, but no shit. No that shit. Particularly reassuring. Incendio. <laughs> Was it arachnophobia? I suppose if you had that, this would probably suck for you. Especially imagine it doing it like VR or something. Fuck you. Ow. Ow. Fuck you. Fuck, fuck. Fuck you, dude. Get off me. Try, bitch. I forgot which way I came from. That way, right? That other way was the uh, uh, shortcut way out. Oh, wait. Fuck. No, I went the wrong way. God dang it. You say there's like a left turn here? Above me or something? Off. 
How do I do? No, that goes that way. I didn't go that way. Shit. No, he died. Master, if you find Tob's body, the big spider was too much. Tob's has failed you and deserves this punishment. Tob's feels weak, sleepy. Tob's must. Such beautiful handwriting for somebody that was dying. Poor Tob's. Left here alone with the spiders. Mm-hmm. trying to cremate him a little bit, you know. Leech, leeches, leeches. I don't really remember what the reason was I was looking for him. a way out. Hold on. To blow that up there first. Come on. Okay. Seems I'm back at the entrance to the cave. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. Yep. Let's tell Deke about his friend. Poor guy. Friend's dead! Good thing I can just like fly through the canopies like this. A lot of people around here, it seems like. A lot of enemies. It's been ages since I've found it. I'm always given the dull tasks. Beasts were made to be skinned and eaten. A lot of enemies down here. It's bad I can't like just snipe them from up here, you know. It's all right, fuck it. Confringo. 
Fuck you, dude. Ow. That did hurt a little bit. Have my little sweet. I think I do. Yeah, I do. Shit. I was looking down at my phone. I wasn't paying attention. Rebellion. Oh, okay. Lumos. Revelio. <laughs> Lumos. I don't know what those peeps are doing now. <gasps> no! God dang it. I need my... I don't know what they're doing. They're battling something down there, but... Got other things to worry about for now. And then third one. Those two. Did see something over here. It's... Bombarda. There you are. Lumos. That's that. Settled. Now my curiosity has me. I kind of want to see what they were fighting. Uh, oh, a troll. Okay. Oh, he beaten the, the asses. Whatever. God dang it, dude. Why do I keep falling off that bridge? Sheesh. Look at those airstreams. Oh, super fast. Is Highwing all right? Natty told me what the two of you did. Highwing is fine. Highwing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe, Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want Highwing far from it. 
You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead, and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack? It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Hauntel Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. Why? What is it? The poachers best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making, at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poachers spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Your gran? Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? <laughs> this way. Lead on. Lead on. Yes, that's right. The fuck is that? Centaur. The centaur? Tread carefully. Okay. Don't make eye contact. An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. That'd be awesome if a, a charmer. full uh, platoon of them came in and helped us and F some of these poachers up. But why would he think that we had anything to do oh, with poachers? So pretty. I did that. notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. It's gotta be cold out here. Oh shit! My goodness. Seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. Damn, I nature, you crazy. It's almost like there's something in the water. It's like a crocodile. Jump after a wildebeest or something. This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. I think it. Hurry up, puppy. Drinking. Pelt. Poor beasts. Okay, what else am I searching for here? Down here in the 
down. What'd you find? Nothing. Oh. Nice. It's the first time I've seen this. Have I skipped rocks before? I don't remember. What are we looking at? Neither do I. My uh, spider senses are tingling. How do goblin and poacher interests align? Look down there. Yeah, Dead look creatures. at the look at the castle. No creatures, so oh my goodness! Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. So pretty. Or perhaps a less discreet approach. Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. Hmm. Quite a few of them, it seems. See, again. S sniper. Boom. 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 Take them all out. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can sneak up in this dude. Can't figure out why there's such a fuss over poaching. There's enough dumb beasts for everyone. Kind of want to at least take the uh, the big guys out, you know, the stronger guys. Without anybody noticing. I would say that Irondale is not appropriate. Bye. Oh, oh. Bye. Where did I set my traps? The lower or upper Fuck you. Field? Perhaps I'll scout around Felcroft for something to poach. Make our presence known now. Fuck, wrong one. She didn't fall with the bridge. Dang it. Merlin, you'd think they were guarding the minister for magic himself. What is going on here? Only one way to find out. Nice. I needed a Wigan weld. I blew up the bridge. Sorry. Repair it. Repair it. Nice. Oh my 
What in Merlin's name? Wow, that was cool. It's a dragon fight. It's a dragon fighting room. This is Horntel Hall. The name makes sense now, and the secrecy. No wonder the poachers were in Hogsmeade so much. Likely taking pets and spreading the word, given how crowded it is here. How could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard kind. There must be more dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being on the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. Oh man, I hope I ride a dragon. What I wouldn't give to be a demagogue right now. Can I get up to this guy? Then I what Victor was sinking straight at the dragon's totalis. Entry with the mission only. Oh man, let's fucking watch this thing for a little bit. Morally wrong or not, I mean, in a fantastical world, this has uh, got to be an awesome sight, right? Much better than a fucking chicken fight. They're just going to circle each other. Hmm. Pretty sway. Okay. Uh, love me some restricted areas. Both of them? Nice. Oh, what is this? Is a uh... uh, poor guys. Did you hear those goblins? Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. What's going on down there? Look through the cloth, stupid. They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite the fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Let's even her up, shall we? Yeah. Have 
Money, 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 money. Even though it's not a lot of money. Hello, Amora. I hope that was a level one, right? Getting bored. Ah, a couple goblins there, a couple dudes there. Yeah, probably. Think upon this guy. Shit, didn't even see that guy. Huh. Couple of dudes. Alright, well I guess we'll throw that shit up at him. Sit down. Uh oh. You're the one we're looking for, and you for a friend. Really? I agree. Uh, not good. She's pissed. This may have been a bad idea. I suppose we'll find out. I suppose we should probably fucking run. Is 
actually gonna light up the entire place. There you go. Run away! Nope. Nope, nope. Ah, to piss myself. So we still gotta get out of there. This way. That was a Hebridean black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. I don't think she knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what should we do with the egg, though? Since the dragon we freed flew off, does that mean we get to keep the egg? I'd much rather we have it than the poachers, at least for now. But I don't think we should keep it indefinitely. It'll be hard hiding something like this from Professor Weasley for long. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. Be careful, Word. you. I shall see you back at the castle. That's pretty cool. It's time you learned the transformation spell. After you've completed the required tasks, which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide, attend my class to learn the new spell. <laughs> Afterwards, we will discuss your progress thus far in the term. Okay. Last child by the house. I think it's a good place to uh, to stop. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. That was pretty cool. The dragon was pretty cool. Um. Kind of wish we got to ride that thing, you know? Um, like maybe it saves us or something from all those po poachers and we ride it back to its den and we're like, oh, here, here's your egg, you know, here, and it's all happy and then we have like a new dragon friend. But uh, I guess not, whatever. Um, anyways, I'm still enjoying the game. Um, I know I'm probably a little little behind on it, but I think it's, it's still cool. I mean, it's not overly difficult which is is nice because if it was like so difficult it'd be annoying to like try to keep doing missions over and over and over and over again but uh, at the same time it's it's not completely easy either um it's nice it's nice to kind of just sit back vibe and look at the landscapes and just kind of do your thing so i'm enjoying it guys but um you know hit that like button um subscribe Throw a comment down. Let me know what you, what you guys are up to. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. So wherever you are in the world, have a good day. Have a good night. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Later.